Hello again to everybody who is coming back to my channel and joining me for another video. Welcome to anybody who is new. It is day four of doing the dustpan technique. Yesterday, ah, yesterday was so much fun. Came out super awesome. I love it when you get a painting like that. It's so much more fun than one where you get to the end and you're like, eh, it's okay. <laughs> or that's horrible. Um, so. I am excited to keep going and do these last uh, couple paintings today and tomorrow and let's hope that they turn out as good as yesterday. <laughs> let's do some painting. Okay, it was really cool and now I'm feeling like it's really not mm -hmm. because I like went too far this way it almost kind of looks like mountains if I was to tip the rest of this off
Uh, for this, I'm just gonna stop. Hmm, I'm not really sure what to do with all of this. There is so much paint still in here. <laughs> all right, you guys. Well, this is definitely not what I planned here. But super, super cool. To me, it looks like some really crazy mountains with a really crazy sunset. <laughs> what do you guys think? What do you see? I, uh, I don't even know. Well, I'll bring you back in just a second and show you what this one looks like dry. And I might bring you back in a second and do something with this other, this leftover paint that's in, um, in this dustpan. Just do a double painting in a video. I don't know. Give me one second. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna, I can't stand to waste paint. So I'm just gonna do something and see what happens. I couldn't waste that. So cool. Now that I figured out the dang ring pour, it may be one of, one of my favorite techniques. Um, this is super cool. So I guess you guys got a two for two for one video. I will bring you guys back in just a little bit and show you what these two ended up looking like dry. All right, you guys. Here they are dry. So, hmm. I love the rainbow in this one. This one just kind of bums me out because I really wish that I wouldn't have tilted it so far that it messed this side up, you know, and that I had to cover up that rainbow. This ring pour is super, super cool. The rainbow behind it is super, <laughs> super cool. I love both parts of it, just, I don't know, just that it's covering the whole bottom half. That's what I don't like about it. I don't know. Anyways, and then this one, this is pretty cool looking. <laughs> I hate to be a negative Nelly, but I am bummed that, that the light purple got so dark and it almost just looks like one, one color purple. But 
the uh, ring pour on top looks super, super cool. I really, really like this one overall. I mean, they're both pretty cool. Not, not necessarily a bad day. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching, you know, both paintings come to be and leave me a comment and let me know. Give me a thumbs up if you did enjoy the video. Consider subscribing if you have not subscribed. Share with a friend and I will see you guys in the next one.